Hey, what is going on, YouTube? Welcome back. I've been waiting and waiting and waiting to give you guys a lineup update, and it's finally going to happen. With the 20 million coin team, it's finally here. I think it's pretty much done. I wanted all the golden tickets to come out first. And so I hope you guys understand why there hasn't been any best team in Madden's or anything like that in a while. Because we were building. And we were waiting. Now when I say this team is worth 20 million coins, I, I legitimately mean it. And I'll show you guys after. Uh, this includes, we have Tier 1 Madden coach. <laughs> that, that man is expensive. Uh, he's like 3 or 4 million coins on himself. So it's actually more than 20. But 20 sounds pretty cool. So I'm going to show you guys my lineup with the way it is set in game currently. Then I'll go back and I'll show you how it's all set up in the depth chart. All the boosts, full, good stuff. Uh, so this is the line we have. Now I know you guys, it's not the best line in the game. But it, but it, it, it's, it does absolutely fine. It's the same as anything else. Uh, and then at tight end we got Shannon Sharp, Tony Gonzalez, Evan Ingram. We got a little Bo Jackson hiding down here too. It's pretty good. At quarterback, I wanted to get Golden Ticket Michael Vick, but I really wanted Conductor. So we got Lamar Jackson. I kept a Vick. We're not, we're not getting rid of Mike. Mike is still here. Mike can come in. He's still going to win a game. But we got Lamar. Now we're rolling with Calvin and Julio, our receivers one and two. You guys know I really only run two receiver sets. Uh, but in case anyone gets tired, we got Sterling Sharp here, who I'd pulled. We just kept and held on to. And I love to run the ball. Uh, so we got Barry, Saquon, 98 Ladanian. I didn't see any need to ever upgrade him to 99. And then I still have Earl Campbell here because I need a little bit of trucking back. I'm waiting. Maybe we get a Bo Jackson at some point. Uh, and then, you know, I don't ever actually use a fullback. So Ripkowski, you're here. Now on defense. This team is dirty on defense. We got Sean Taylor, 99. Of course, everyone's got Sean Taylor, right? At right outside linebacker, I will be playing Leonard Floyd there. Just out of position. Um, he's going to be right or left. It just depends sometimes um, what I'm doing. But he is the man of the hour for us right there. At middle linebacker, because I play 3-3-5, LaDainian Tomlinson is going to be playing back. I know a lot of people may not be liking Ladanian. Man's got footsteps. I gotta try it out. I gotta see how it works. I got a feeling it's gonna be pretty nice. He's fast. It's great. On the other side, Shazier. So I use her my outside linebackers a lot. So I wanted Floyd and Shazier out there. Inter you know, you can flip them around. Additionally, they both can blitz pretty well. Because the Shazier's got, where is it, where, where are you, Ryan? He's got 96 power move, unboosted. That's pretty good. I'll take it forever, I need to blitz him. And we got my man, the stunt man, Eric Berry, locking down a strong safety. So we got secure tackler, all back there. At cornerback, Calvin Johnson plays cornerback for me. I know, but he does. Same thing, Randy Moss, cornerback. He's amazing. Marlon Humphrey in the slot with Night Train at four. I know that seems a little weird. I don't really run a lot of four, four DB sets, but Night Train's too good. I'm, I'm not selling him. I love Night Train. And then power up DRC at five. If I ever want to play man, DRC, you come in. Now there's a card up here. Von Miller's not really played right now. He's a depth card for me, but he's a power-up. He gives the motivator block shed. He's great. Uh, I love him. If I had to make one change, I would sell LT and get Vaughn. But if we have this out here, this is pretty good. So we have Aaron Donald starting at D-tackle. Secure tackler under pressure. Perfect. He activates under pressure for Mac, who's on this end, who's who, who, who gets in a lot. Mac gets in a lot for us. And then we're using Lawrence Taylor down here. So the only person on our defense without secure tackler is Khalil Mack. And I'm okay with that. Additionally, we've got Mean Joe as a backup whenever we you know, we need to go really heavy. Uh, we got power up Brandon Graham, which is probably a bad idea. 
motivators Drell Casey sitting here as well. This is the team. This is the team. This is how it looks when you're on the field against me. It sucks to play against me. Trust me, this is how the lineup and the depth chart is truly, true, tr tr truly set up to get all the chemistries uh, that we need. You see we've got 24 to 18 on toughness, 19 on physical front, 14 on good deep. It's pretty good. So we use Motivator Vaughn, Motivator Wake, Motivator Casey, Motivator Matthew. The reason we have to use Motivator Matthew is only for Vaughn Miller at this point. Uh, he's the only one who actually gets the boost. But it's okay. Uh, if we ever use Vaughn, he does have 91 zone now. Otherwise, nobody else really needs it. Um, it could come in handy. Uh, we've got Telvin as a nice backup there. Uh, we got Roquan, who's Nat. Deion Jones just waiting for him to get a card. Whenever he gets a card, we're going to get it anyway. Uh, he may not play a lot, or um, he may take a Ladanian spot, honestly. Uh, so that's the way I've set it up here. Offensively, we use motivators at run block and pass block right up here. Sub those guys out so everything works really well. The reason it works really well here, as you can sort of see, is... 99 strength, 97 run block, 99 pass block, 99 impact block. It's pretty good. He's pretty good. Let's look at Lamar Jackson. Fully boosted for us. 95 speed, 99 throw power, 96 short, 94 mid, 95 deep. He's good. I don't know why the game's glitching out right now, but it is. But it is. Uh, it's going to freeze on me at some point here probably. Ryan Chazier, the only 90. Eights he has on the compare screen are speed, awareness, play rec, and block shit for me. It's legitimately the best card in the game. He's legitimately the best card in the game. That's crazy. Uh, even look at Ladanian. Fully boosted out for me. 96 speed, 94 tackles, fine. Eight, the block shed and the hit power a little low. I know Ladanian's a little short. That's fine. Uh, he's going to he's gonna get things done, man. He's got better agility than Chazier, so he's actually going to move a little bit easier for us. Uh, same thing with Moss right here. Very, very good. 99 speed. <sighs> this team is great. You guys are going to see some gameplay this week. You guys are going to see gameplay this week of this team in action. And I'm going to try and do it a little more regularly. I want the gameplays that I'm going to be posting... I'm not going for the whole entertainment value things. I'm going to maybe show and teach you guys talk talk Madden as we play. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. This team is 20 million coins. Uh, let's pull up the mutt head. Here we have mutt head. We see that the total value of the team, this isn't even every card, doesn't include, like for power-ups, if you put a power-up there, it's worth zero coins. But they're worth a lot more than that in my opinion. Obviously, it's at 18.4 million coins with no coach or anything in there. It's a 20 million coin team, guys. 20 mil. I'm out.